331 Storm Cracker Meteorologist Carson Meredith with 31 Triple Dollar. It's another frigid day out there, sure so make is. sure you bundle up. Yeah, need and those, layers. Yeah, need those layers this morning, but you can shed those layers as the day goes on. It's going to be more mild as I this say, afternoon. Shed them. Well, I'm not, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I'm not going to do that, but it is going to be a nice afternoon. Let's talk about what you can't expect on this Wednesday. There will be more clouds out there today, but again, you'll need the heavy coat to start. You can get away with a light jacket later on this afternoon. And as far as those clouds are concerned, it's that thin, wispy kind of stuff. So we'll still have plenty of sunshine today. Just might not be that brilliant blue sky like we saw yesterday. For any evening plans you might have, it's all quiet. Those clouds will stay with us, but it will get chilly. When you wake up tomorrow morning, we'll be back in the 20s yet again. It's 29 now in Huntsville this morning, 25 in Decatur, 27 in the Shoals. Gunnersville still holding on to 30 degrees, but you still need to bundle up. You can see those thin clouds are still streaming yet, and they'll be with us not just today, but really through the rest of the week. Now, despite those clouds, our forecast does remain dry through at least Saturday. 31 triple Doppler will remain quiet. Our next rain chance comes into play Christmas Eve night and Christmas Day on Monday still looking like a washout. We'll update you on those rain chances in just a moment. Your high temperatures today back to where they should be in late December. 55 today in Hudsville, also in Decatur. 56 are forecast in Muscle Shoals, 53 in Athens, 54 in Fayetteville, 54 in Scottsboro, and 52 today in Fort Payne. It's going to be a very mild Christmas this year. It's always one or the other. It's either really, really cold or a little bit warm. It's going to be on the warmer side this year. We're near 60 on Friday, 63 Saturday, 65 degrees for Christmas Eve on Sunday. Maybe just a lighter jacket for the holiday itself, but unfortunately you're going to need the umbrella. That rain arrives when Santa's moving through North Alabama Sunday night, and once that rain gets here, it's going to stay with us throughout your Christmas day. The highest rain chances for now look to be during the morning and afternoon hours on Monday. Not expecting much in the way of thunderstorms. We're not worried about severe weather at all. More than anything else, this just looks like a good old fashioned soaking rain that could have a couple of heavier downpours, which could lead to some ponding on the roads. Just keep that in mind as you're out and about on the holiday. When we still need the rain, we'll get a good drink of water on Christmas Day. Upwards of one inch of rain expected area wide. That should not be enough to cause some flooding concerns, but it could help a little bit with that drought that is still lingering across North Alabama. Look at your 10 day forecast. You notice those temperatures remain in the low 60s for Christmas Day itself. Could have a few lingering showers Tuesday morning, but once that system scoots out of here, we'll dry things out for the middle part of next week and we'll also cool back down into the 50s.